That was Chris Wolf reporting. We are following breaking news in Boyle Heights right now where a river rescue is underway. Yeah, that water is just churning. KTLA's Gil Levis overhead in Sky 5. Gil? Center Pedro, a desperate situation here. LA City Fire trying to rescue this guy right in the center of your screen. This is in the LA River right at Washington Boulevard very close to Soda Street. You can see a lot of wind here. That's because LA City Fire helicopters over here, they're going to try to do a hoist. In fact, here comes the, one of the uh, personnel in that helicopter coming down to do that hoist rescue. The person desperately hanging onto the side of the wash there. It's a straight sheer wall. Oh. Again, the water moving quite swiftly through here, and luckily he's able to hold on for dear life there. As I come out to a wide shot, you'll see that uh, rescuer coming down to do the hoist rescue. Very technical situation here for the for the helicopter there to bring this uh, rescuer down right on top of him. Very difficult, but they're doing a great job. They're almost to him right now. They try to lower a vest uh, a vest for the, the person, but they were not able to get it to him. And now the rescuer here try, having a little bit difficult time. They're gonna, he's trying to direct the helicopter to get back closer to the uh, the guy on the side there, but he is just hunkered down there against that uh, sheer wall and uh, hanging on so that he doesn't get swept away. Oh, what a precarious situation. We've got the helicopter getting tossed around by the wind. We have this rescuer getting tossed around by the heavy waves on that thin cable just trying desperately to get close to the uh, the person who needs rescue. And you can see him giving those hand signals to goes. someone up above, Gil. And right now, finally, yeah, definitely. He's doing the just about there. He's just about there. They're just sliding that helicopter over gently over. They have some issues. They have some uh, power lines overhead to deal with. Oh. And uh, you can see the wind just uh, causing a problem there. But he's very close to the guy. He's almost there. He's going to put that sling around his bottom of his legs and then uh, hoist him up really quick as soon as they get him secure there just about there let me come in for a tighter shot as you see the guy reaching out with one arm and uh here we go let's see he's got him he's got him in his clutches he's hanging on to that wire there and oh. he's going to try to get that hoist around him very difficult Ooh. to do wow look at that fortunately the the uh the guy they're rescuing here is able to have the strength to hang on tight and here he goes up in the air he's up and he's letting go of that rope whatever he was holding there there we go he's let that go the cable and now he's going to go up into the helicopter safe and sound wow. here in just a second. You can see L.A. City firefighters there that were working to try to get him off the side of that wall. But again, L.A. River moving quite rapidly, a lot of water in there. And L.A. City Fire doing a great job here to rescue this guy off that side of that sheer wall in the river. I am that so impressed. Incredible. Gil, you can see that man must have been in the river a while. So cold. Look how red his skin is. You could see his hands and a little yeah. bit of his back. Uh, so dangerous. And right into the helicopter. Boy, quite a job by that L.A. City Fire crew there in the helicopter. Rescue 5 there pulling that man to safety. But yeah, quite a dramatic scene. LA City Fire got the call around five o'clock of uh, someone in the riverbed here, and they certainly found him right away. But uh, there he is, safe and sound in the helicopter, out of the water, and uh, he'll be off to the hospital for evaluation. Well, that is absolutely incredible. It really we, was. Uh, I mean, LA City Fire trains for this, but yeah. until you see it in action and everything that they're up against, the weather conditions, the wind, and that rushing water, and they just pulled him up so quickly. So good ending for that. Gil, thank you.